I'm concerned because this is my community. Uh, this, I don't think uh, that we want uh, to see uh, Traverse City with a junkie on every corner. Law enforcement in northern Michigan is battling a growing drug problem, and they agree changes need to be made. You know, the, the problem is, is we take one off the street and two or three replace them. There's no doubt that uh, these drugs are coming from southeast Michigan, Detroit, Flint, Saginaw, and that they're marketing them to our uh, kids and to our folks here in northern Michigan. Cooney says even though his office works aggressively with the Traverse Narcotics team to prosecute these cases, it's just not enough. We've had the same number of narcotics officers on the uh, narcotics team since I started back in 1993 and since then the population of the county has gone from 65,000 to nearly 91,000. Resources keeping pace with the increase in population is something Sergeant Keith Gillis couldn't agree with more. And we're, you know, our complaint load is four times the amount of volume plus you, the, the drug problem that we have currently is probably ten times what it was five years ago. Cooney wants to put together a presentation for the hotel owners because it's often a place of business for dealers so that uh, hotels know what to look for. You know, a lot of times these uh, operations can't go on if there isn't a place for them to set up shop. Reporting in Grand Traverse County, Gabriella Pagan, 7 and 4 News.